Hey guys, we're gonna do a review today of a wireless microphone set. We've been using the Rode mic here for quite a while now. It's a single mic and it works really good. Well, I saw this one, this is called Interview. It's the KTW1. Uh, this is a dual uh, wireless mic. It's about the same size in that as what the uh, smaller versions are. So it's really a nice little, it comes with two separate things. So if more than one of you want to be on the same video and both record at the same time, you can do that because this will take on two different uh, voices at one time. And it's really cool. Uh, it's small, you can, uh, I'll show you a little more about it here in a second, but as you can see on the front of it, how small they are. They're just, there are three units. One is the transmitter, one's a receiver. And actually there's two transmitters, one receiver, and hooked into whatever device you want. Right now I have it hooked into my little, uh, it's, it's a uh, small action camera, and I'm using it as a wireless device here. It has a little wind muff on it. I'm using that because I'm outside, and there's just a lot, slight breeze gone. So, uh, you know, there, you could get a little noise in the background. Uh, we're right next to a skydive area here and I hear an airplane up in the air. I don't know if you can pick that up or not or on the mic, because uh, this is about sound, this there. Uh, the trees are moving in the background, and we'll show you a little view though, but this is a wireless. We, we ordered this. Uh, they're, they're really inexpensive compared to some of the others. I've been wanting one, but I didn't want to spend $300 on a, a wireless, uh, dual wireless pickup mic, you know? And this was a lot less than that. I'll leave a link in Amazon in the uh, section below. But the, uh, it has a uh, Fundality sound quality built-in microphone, a 500M operating, I guess that's millimeter, and it's made for uh, iOS, Android, and a camera. They're, uh, they're great for like something like karaoke, uh, video conferencing, uh, internet chats, uh, live streams and you can use it all. I just I just got this yesterday HD display has a little display on the front of it high com high compatibility Fidelity sound quality uh, Down you can adjust your sound up and down 50 meters transmission. I don't know what that is in feet. I usually only deal with feet I'll see how I figure that out has a built-in microphone a built-in battery life I think it can last up to like five hours real-time monitoring so you can put an earphone into this and monitoring what your sound is like coming out of it here's some more of the uh, stats on it the model is kt uh, w1 it has a 500 milliamp capacity battery uh, it has working current current of 160 to 10 mah an ra frequency of 570 to 598 Number of channels, there's 32 channels for each AB, for each side. Audio frequency is 500 to 1500 Hertz. Harmonic distortion is 0 0.1. Floor noise is uh, 70 dB. SN is 70 dB. Working time is about five hours. That's pretty good, really. Operation is uh, 50 millimeters. So, and you know, the, the length and all that can go depending on d different things on how far it goes away, instructions in the side of it. But I'm using it right now. Uh, I'm actually recording with it at this moment. So you can kind of get an idea of what it sounds like because I'm actually using it. All right, let's uh, kind of see what comes up in the box. Okay, I wanted to show you a few of the things that come along with it. Actually, this is a wind muff that goes right on top of the unit. And I'm, I'm using it right now because it's kind of windy out here. So it does come with a wind muff. There's a lanyard here. This lanyard you can hook onto your camera, right? But it's a nice little uh, add-on to it. Now, it's got two different ones of these, depending on whether you're using it on like a cell phone, a computer, uh, what it may be. There's one for each style that you may need. And it comes with those, a nice little coiled co cord. And then these two here has like something a Mac would use the end of it that'll go into the, the Mac port or they call it a lightning. This one here happens to be a C, has one for the C unit. And then this one has the, I guess they call that a lightning port. So they have one of those for each one of them. And then it comes with two lavalier microphones. 
one for each unit. So if, if you want to use a lavalier mic, you can, or it actually does have a built-in uh, mic itself right on the unit. You don't even have to use these, but if you want to uh, put it in your pocket or something, just have the mic sticking out, you can do that. It has a neat little bag, put all your accessories in it. It's actually called Warm Arter, as is the name of the brand. Like I said, again, I'll leave a link to it in Amazon. And uh, I've just so far been very impressed with it. Uh, we do a live stream on uh, YouTube uh, every Monday. Every Monday night it's uh, 6 p.m. we do one. And me and Sue both talk at the same time. We've had some issues with the sound. Us both hearing good in the sound. So this should take care of it. We'll each have our own dedicated microphone. And it'll be wireless. We won't be strapped down to however far it may be, you know. So... Uh, so far, I'm very pleased, and we're, we're continuing to test it there, and we're actually going to be doing our first live stream with it this next coming Monday night, so we'll check that out. All right, I'm going to walk away from it. If you can see, here is the microphone itself. Let me take that off one second and show it to you. This is the little wind muff at the top of it. Uh, it has an on-screen display, which is very visible to it has a volume actually this on this side isn't the volume this is to change channels if you need to change channel frequencies it has a us or a c plug that you can plug it in to uh, charge it back up the one little uh thing is a reset button but the one at the bottom here it'll it'll be red and then when it's fully charged it'll go out but it's really really interesting at the top there's a place you can plug in your lavalier mic and i'm going to uh, put this back on I've always used these this way here. I've just put it to my thing. But I'm going to walk away and show you the distance. I mean, I can walk away from the microphone and it should be able to hear me. I can go over here and sit down and wave at you. And you should be able to hear me just like I'm right up on the mic. My, my little Maggie can come up here. Lacey, you can come see us. She doesn't talk much on the, on the mic. But yeah. As you can see that way, and two of us can be done that. We can be two different directions, up to 50 millimeters away. I look at see how many millimeters it is. I, I'm not sure. I'm I'm a, a, a imperial person. I don't do millimeters, but see how far away that is. But I'm sure it's quite a little distance on it. I see an airplane going across there. But as you can see, you can walk around and uh, use it different. You're not tied right to the camera or a cord there by being wireless. It's just a it's a great such a, right now I'm getting a good gust of wind. I'm curious to hear the playback and to see if you can hear that wind or not. You know, it's uh, my past with these, they call these a dead cat and it, it cuts out a lot of wind. They all always work pretty good. So anyway, that shows you a little bit of how you can move around and you're not just stuck to the, uh, the camera with a cord. Yeah, I wanted to show you, it's a little windy. Actually, there's uh, weather station there you can see it's going around it the wind is coming and gone so i did want to show you that there is some wind show up in the trees and that but there is some windy it's not extremely windy today but this will give you an idea what it sounds like with the wind muff on and uh, i don't know yet because i haven't even tried that part out but i just kind of wanted to show you the weather conditions out here today it's a beautiful spring day in florida and we'd like to come out here on the deck so i thought what a great place to start doing a little interview or a little review of this mic. Looked it up, and 60 meters with 60 amp, I believe that is 164 feet. 150 meters is 164 feet. That's quite a little ways. Uh, the house here is further than that, so you can probably talk that far on. I tell you what, I'm going to do. I'm going to. I'm going to go in the house and let's just do a quick little test. And uh, we're just going to show you a little around, and I'm going to continue to talk. And uh, actually, uh, I'm going to walk inside the house. And this is a cement block house. And just going to walk in and back around and see if you lose me or not, you know. So this is what we're going to do. So we're inside the house now. And I don't know if you'll notice the difference of the uh, uh, what it's like in here. Because you get a different sound echoes and stuff in the house. But I'm just kind of walking around the house here. And this is just a test to see how far it can be between the walls right now. And I just want to see at any one point if we lose any sound or if it's disruptive or anything. So uh, we're going to check that out and see how, how, that, 
how that works out. I mean, I've used that ones with pretty good luck with them. Gosh, I'm cured now. The other in the house with several different sounds here. I'm going to walk here. I have a fishing here. That's just a little distance how far that I can walk away from the main unit and be able to still get a good with a wireless on it. Now you got to remember there's two of these. Well, I'm only using one right now. There's two of Two people can be talking at the same time and it goes into the same camera. Hey, I'm back on it. So how did I do? Did I, did you lose me or not? So we're going to find out. All right. I wanted to show you the hookup that I have here. Now I use these mics to do my uh, live chats. Uh, me and Sue uh, both use a mic. So here's our input. We're using it on our Mac. And I just leave it here most of the time. The uh, hookup, I have a uh, cord running there so it keeps charged up all the time. And then I just use, that's your output into a adapter into my uh, uh, Mac. I just have a uh, mic and a earphone adapter. That's where I run it into. Here's where I made a little charging station for the uh, transmitters. They can set right up here on the side. I have these little clips. Let's see if I can show you that. And I made those with my 3D printer. And then I can just easily clip that on the side there. And then I can plug it in. I have my cords here. So when I'm done, I can charge them back up. And when I need them, they're all recharged, ready to go. So that's how I set that up. It looks like a little complicated setup, but this works out really good for our monday live chat all right well here's my review of the uh, warm archer this is a dual wireless mic system i'm really going to like this a lot so i would recommend it i think you guys ought to give it a try i'll leave a link below in the amazon so if you want to click on the link there and uh, you can order it right from there but i tell you this is really a handy little mic and it's really not as expensive as some of the other brands so i hope you guys enjoyed my little review of the dual mic system the uh, warm archer this is a uh, pretty cool little setup for a very well priced wireless microphone it uh, definitely uh, is, a, is a good one so guys if you enjoy it give us a thumbs up if you're not a subscriber i invite you to hit the subscribe button we do all kinds of reviews and many other types of videos. We have a Monday live chat every Monday, 6 p.m. Eastern time. So join us sometime and we talk about anything and everything. So I hope you guys enjoy. We'll see you the next time. Thanks for watching.